Hello my Pixel people, I am Pixel and welcome to this, a quick channel update. Before we start the video, I just need to point out two little differences. One, I'm actually quite ill, my throat feels like it's on fire, so if my voice starts crackling up and going crazy all over the place, I do apologise. And second of all, this is going to be the first video where I actually attempt to do some fancy editing. Hopefully. I know, amazing, right? Pixel's gonna do a video where he just doesn't talk from the start to the end of it in one big massive long take. Alas, one cannot always rely on his ability to chat meaningless drivel for extended periods of time and every now and again needs to actually do some fancy editing to make his content progress. And so, that's enough of that. Here's what we've got coming up in this video. We are going to look at the different coloured pixel monsters and hopefully explain to you guys what they actually mean. Hopefully this will help you guys figure out what content you actually will enjoy and also the content that you may want to avoid because it literally serves no interest to you. After that we will delve a little bit deeper into some of the ideas we have for new shows slash series. Hopefully get some feedback from you guys and get you guys involved because, to be honest, I'm actually really excited to some of these new ideas that we've got. Also, we are going to be looking at our current content and speak about the plans moving forward. Unfortunately, it seems like I'm running out of Valve games and Portal 2 is close to the end, so I need to keep you guys engaged and I'm worried about it and I need to talk to you guys about it and hopefully you guys will stick with me, please, I hope. And finally, we will try and explain the truckloads of content which is about to hit the channel. This is most likely going to be a really bad couple of weeks because of the amount of content we want to push out. You guys are probably going to get a little bit annoyed, but please, if you if you listen to the end of the video, then maybe we can get you onto our wavelength and you'll understand why we are doing it and the benefits to you guys in future, and then it'll all be good. I hope. Please, just bear with us on that. But first, I want to pimp out our social networks a little bit. I have left links in the description to our Facebook, our Twitter, our Google Plus, and our Steam. If you have any of these services, then please make sure you take the time to connect to us. We have lots of plans to get you guys involved in future content, and we are also doing lots of little mini giveaways and competitions. We have recently started a little event called Hashtag Know Your Games on our social networks, and basically what this show is, is we post up a tiny little section of an in-game screenshot. And then it's down to you guys at home to figure out what game this screenshot actually came from. The first person to get a correct answer will be given five lottery tickets. Five. And then everybody else that gets the answer correct after the first person will be given one lottery ticket. And then at the end of the day, we will take all these entries, put them into a hat, or maybe use something like random.org. I've not fought it through yet. And we will pick a winner which will be announced on the next episode or ed next edition, should I say, of hashtag know your games. So yeah, I'm really excited for that. Hopefully it should be quite a lot of fun. We've already been doing a few episodes, so go and check them out if you're going to join to our networks now. And yeah, so get involved, get connected and be sure to say hi. Once again, links are in the description. Colours. We have six of them and they will be used to help you get an understanding of what our videos are all about. Orange, for instance, is all about our featured content. Basically, we want you to watch this stuff and by stuff, I mean channel updates, general features and odd bits and bats of content. We believe that the majority of the people on the channel should enjoy any videos with a little orange logo on them. When it comes to the blue colour, this is more of the colour for our let's plays, our random commentaries, our quick play lives. And this is basically all our personality driven content, so if you like just watching me play games, then the blue monster is more than likely what you're going to be want to be watching. Red is when it comes down to tips and tricks, esports stuff, so maybe a few commentaries in future. I'm not 100% certain yet, but red is going to be mainly for tips and tricks, like if you want to play a certain game better, then this will be the colour that you want to watch. Yellow is the one that I'm really kind of worried about because this could be considered spam slash basic content to be honest trailers gameplay videos quick clips how-to videos most of this stuff we expect to get views from search however check the title out you never know some of it may interest you green is going to be our regular features top tens reviews previews all that kind of good stuff really we'll go into some of the new ideas for shows in a later section but right now we know that our 
green pixel monster isn't being shown much love when it comes to the subscribers and we would really like to change this we believe that this is going to be the content which will become the foundation of this channel in future so if you see that little green monster just give it a try guys if you don't like it fair enough but i would really appreciate it if you actually gave them a look purple slash pink depending on how you look at it this is going to be our content that does, that does not fall into any other slots so kind of a mix between the orange and the green really i might i may do a mini series in this color i may do event coverage in this color i don't know yet this is going to be our basic backup color so if it's pink i don't know you may like it you may not like it i can't really attest to that but definitely give it a try and yeah, so with that said, that's all the colours. I hope that you guys understand what they mean and hopefully it will entice you to try some of more of the Pixel Twitch flavours in future. So yeah. Okay, so what ideas for new shows have we actually got? I would like to start out by making a quick announcement for a show that I am in fact very, very excited for. And that show is Mailbox. Many channels have done a Mailbox style content thing in the past. And I'd like to join them. I honestly believe that I've got quite a lot of knowledge on the games industry and games in general. So what will happen is we will more than likely answer two questions per day. One from the mailbox email, which I will provide in the description below. And the other one from social networks, which will be most likely a shorter question, obviously, because of the character restrictions on Twitter and stuff. So, if you've got any questions that you would like me to try and tackle on the channel, then please do use that email address provided below. I am really excited to get this started off. Hopefully, this will become a daily series in future. I don't expect to get so many emails right at the start, but if I do, that's great. I'm really excited. Hope that happens. Other content that I'm planning to bring to the channel includes a vlog, which will be a weekly video of me basically sitting in front of a webcam talking about what's going on in my life, maybe some plans for the channel, blah, 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 that kind of stuff. You know, vlogs. It, it, it's what a vlog is. The stuff like top 10s and top 5s and all that kind of stuff that I've spoken about in the past is still very much on the cards. However, I just need to make sure that I get into a better rhythm in making my videos because... This video, for instance, is the first time I've done some heavy editing and I'm three days into recording this when I expect it to take maybe one or two days. I'm not very good at this bit yet. Hopefully I will improve with a little bit of practice. So that kind of content is definitely still on the cards and I'm actually really excited to be able to pump that stuff out in future. I would also like to announce that I plan to heavily cover Wildstar when it releases. Wildstar's for you guys that don't know is basically an MMO, kind of like your World of Warcraft, Except it really doesn't seem to take itself too seriously. It's got a great art style. Almost looks like a Pixar movie. And it, it, it's also just got great humour. I really hope that this game does well. I will leave a video in the description. Which will take you to a video called What is Wildstar? And it is hilarious. I really hope that you enjoy it guys. Because I'm really excited to be doing this kind of content in future. And... Yeah, I really hope that you guys want to come on this journey with me. When it comes to stuff like my um, Let's Plays and stuff, I am working on making my workflow better. And when that happens, I will be able to make these videos more consistently, get them out on time. My sleep pattern, pattern is all over the place. It's 2 a.m. right now and I've only just woke up. So, I apologize for that. Again, hopefully this will improve in future. From now on, I think I'm not going to release a Let's Play episode until I've got the next episode already recorded i know that you guys like talking to me in the comments but just imagine that i'm one part behind maybe and that'll work out okay okay again sorry for the inconsistency i promise you it will get better i am working really hard on this and yeah thanks Finally, I would like to talk about the flurry of new content which is about to hit the channel and explain that this is not just basically spam. It may seem like it, but I assure you there's a reason for everything that I do on this channel. And the reason for all the new videos which are going to be gameplay videos from many different games, first boots from games which are both new and old, is because when it comes to Steam sales, I've always wanted to do my own version of a kind of sale box where I talk about what games I like and if you should go out and get them yourselves while they're on a good deal and also I would like to get myself a decent amount of stock footage for in future and the only way I can actually effectively do 
more detailed videos about certain games in future is by having that content pre-recorded and up on the channel ready to link people to when the time comes. So, that said, in the next few months, I would expect an awful lot of videos coming out. This may spam up and fill up your sub box, and I do apologize for that. Don't feel pressure to watch them all. I mean, don't get me wrong, clicking on them, giving it a quick like and a quick comment it, it is great, and I would very much appreciate that. But it's just a quick warning that there is going to be a lot of random content going up on the channel in the future. And I do apologize if it does feel like spam, but eventually I will get far enough ahead that it will be able to cut down. Because right now, I'm going to be releasing content which is going to span years back. And when I actually catch up, then it will just be new content as it rolls out and it won't feel a, f a fraction as bad. For instance, the four Rise of the Triad videos that went up on the channel yesterday. Okay, so... With all that said, I believe that this video can come to an end. I would normally, well, I was, wouldn't normally, but I'm planning to put an outro at the end of videos in future. I hope that this video shed some light on what's going on in the channel. I hope that you've enjoyed the video and that you feel like it was quite well made. If you have enjoyed the video, don't forget to slap that subscribe button for some more PC gaming goodness. And always like the video if you like the video. I am Pixel. Thanks for watching, guys. More content coming very soon. Thanks for your time. Bye-bye.